It is business since you are known as a monster, you're not a star. Huh. Message. And the way Maxine is set up, she said you want me to be the monster? I'll be the monster. And we can arrive the boogie. Hello. Horror is back. Horror is back. Maxine is back. This movie has been a long time coming. Today we are watching Maxine. If you didn't know, X was one of the first horror movies I watched on my channel and I knew nothing about it. We've done X, Pearl, and now Maxine. If you didn't know, I have reacted to X and Pearl, so you can go watch those. I'm very excited. I have avoided all trailers. I've seen, I think maybe like one or two images. That's it. After Maxine drove away off of that horrid hell house of a ranch where Miss Pearly Pearl went ham. Rip to our girl Jenna. Also Miss Bobby and uh, Kid Cudi's character. Um, I'm gonna call him Daddy Baby Leg if you know you know. So I'm not gonna talk anymore. We're just gonna get into Maxine and see what Miss Max Max has been up to. Come on, one woman show. Cause you know she kind of parallels, obviously she parallels Pearl. So she's a star. That's my little girl. You're gonna be the star of the church one day. In this business, since you are known as a monster, you're not a star. Huh, message. And the way Maxine is set up, she say you want me to be the monster? I'll be the monster. <laughs> Come on. Walk, 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 walk. Walk, 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 bitch, walk. Look at the flow. Come on. Look at the bounce, bounce. Coming in here like she's Farrah Fawcett. Realistically, it can only take me so far. I'm gonna be 33 years old pretty soon. Listen, at least she's self aware. Let's give it a try then, shall we? Maxine Mills, Puritan 2, Mark. Puritan 2. <laughs> it may sound hard to believe, but it's true. I can feel his power inside of me to make me pay for my greatest sin. The sin of living. I mean, come on now. Come on. What are we doing? You cast her. Do you mind taking your top off so we can see your breasts? Hello? So this is the casting couch. What the? Y'all might as well go home because I just can nail that. I know that's right. Let him know. I love how this still is paralleling Pearl. Paralleling? It's still, you know, adjacent to Pearl. Because the way that Pearl had the, the girls outside waiting to go in an audition. And then she comes out. They're still in line. Look how she ate that. With a modern twist. Sure, of a young woman. Causey. Lily Collins is in this? Kevin Bacon is in this? Hollywood sells sin. Experience to work through. Giancarlo is in this? Okay, wait a minute. The landing strip. Maybe Maxine walked like she already owned everything. Everything she walks on, she owns. Wanna hit a party in the house tonight? I'll find the best plastic surgeon on Rodeo Drive. You want me cheap? Will be when the surgeon's my husband. Okay, girl, keep it up. You're gonna be plump with fix a flat. Oh, we had a, a year supply. I mean, if you weren't doing booger sugar, was it the 80s? Was it? Were you were you alive in the eighties? Be night Esquire for you. Okay. You want the good news or the bad news? But they said you weren't a big enough name. <laughs> Look at him. You want to hear the good news? Yeah. What is it? Did we book another corn video? Is that what it is? Who's this? Yeah, celebrities who got their start in horror movies. John Travolta, Demi Moore. Maxine. Kid Minx. Come on, she booked it. <laughs> Brooke Shields is a star. <laughs> Brooke Shields didn't do. He said Brooke Shields. Look, that just proves closed legs don't get fed. What? Is this a serial killer? Mm, was he about to bust or was it just like. Was he angry? What was the emotion there? Hey! Thanks for waiting. Oh. I don't like walking out here alone at night with- Come on, okay. Okay, okay, okay. So has he been, been in anything before or is this our first? Let me get a hot dog real quick so nobody sees me eat. So nobody sees me eat. I have a fit in for a film. I don't know you could ask. Be careful walking home. I can handle myself. So said every fat girl in Hollywood. Oh, she about to die. She's about to die. That whole little part. She just, she just foreshadowed her death. 
authorities still have no identity of the satanic serial killer. The 80s in one sweep, just in that shot. Loved it. Karate, serial killers, war. <laughs> I'm not walking it down a, a dark alley with steam unless Michael Jackson's about to pop out and start singing the way you make me feel. Oh, great. You can run and you can hide, but you'll never get away. I, I don't. I beg to differ. Maxine, you can't go that way. Thank you. Who's not going to get away? I was just playing around. <laughs> were you? Were you really? Strip. Mm. And then I'd be like, now climb over the barbed wire fence while you at it. See, I can come up with some things sometimes. Sup. Open wide. On the ground. <laughs> Face down. Ass up. <laughs> oh, man. Do you know what happened to the last person who tried to kill me? No! Wait, Maxine. I... I don't even have those and my it hurts. It's like Pearl. Not somebody knows. What's that? Nothing. Oh god. I'm gonna head home. Okay. So that's our bestie. Before we go any further, money talks. <laughs> Kevin. I told you still need my help out here. The price is going. Okay, so he's working for somebody. It's Halsey, and it's the girl that was in the dressing room with her. It's the leather glove man. If you so big and bad, go after men. Like, why are we... Go after somebody your own size. Like... I'm gonna be making a life cast to your head for the end of the movie. That's a pretty bitchin' scar. I got shot. All right, I'm gonna put this over your head now to make the mold. No, I couldn't do it. I would literally feel like I'm suffocating. I'm gonna run. I'm gonna get more bandages. And you're not gonna leave me alone with it. I'll be right back. No. And what if it feels and then I can't breathe? Then what? I would start to panic. Panic attack incoming. Five, four, three, two, one. Come on, don't just slap me. And the crazy thing is she probably had to wear this to in real life to make the pearl uh mask. <gasps> That's supposed to be like pearl. Uh. Ooh. Hey, are you okay? No, you left me in here with this stuff on my face and I felt like I was dying. <sighs> we need therapy. I know people didn't do therapy in the 80s. Trauma. We got two bodies, both female. A couple of homos cruising Judy Garland's grave found him floating in the duck pond. Now, why did they have to be all that? They can't just be two people who found her? Pretty girls. I hate to see it. That sucks. He branded them. <laughs> oh, Pearl got blown back. Liz, the director, wants you back on the lot today for a meeting. She can be pretty frightening. I've seen her blow a gasket more than once. I've seen Maxine blow a gasket more than once. <laughs> Satan stole my daughter. You need to go talk to him about that then. I'm not doing that. I'm not calling it. Unless you want to find right in the way back in some Texas jail. Meet me on the 34th floor. His voice can sound kind of, you know. I don't know. Maybe I do it. Honestly, back then, I feel like you could have accused anybody of a crime and been kind of right because I feel like everybody was probably out there doing stuff they weren't supposed to, but there was no cameras and technology and security wasn't top notch. So it's like, you could kind of do whatever. You look a whole lot taller in person. I guess I only ever seen you lying on your back. Oh, are you my number one fan, sir? What do you want? Easy, tiger. I'm just... <laughs> as long as you ain't the balls, because she will crush you. Bobby Lynn Parker. What about Howard and Pearl Douglas? Mm -hmm. You know, they never did catch you murdered. There's no way anyone can pin it on me. <laughs> she pulled the OJ. She said, I didn't do it. If I did do it, this is how I would have did it. Does it weigh on you? As a Christian, I mean, tonight, at this address, it has been requested that you attend. If I don't, you never work in this town again. So are you trying to solve a crime or get a date? Like, my employer is a very powerful man. Don't play chicken with him. You know what? I'd test him. I'd be like, you don't know how sick I am, sir. And then I'd jump out that window. 
Not the Texas Corn Star Massacre. That would be a good movie. Make it. Somebody make that. I'm Detective Williams. This is Detective Torres. Get time for a quick chat? Or somebody who's not known in Hollywood, everybody seemed to know her. Like, leave me alone. You know these girls? Mm -mm. Amber James, Tabby Martin. Never seen them. They are your friends, aren't they? No, I don't have friends. Stop asking me. Don't talk to police. Hmm. Not the crocodile scene. Fair way to find out who made this tape. Why? What's on it? None of your business. He's very attractive. Authorities are following all witness testimony in hopes of zeroing in on the identity of. Her head went pop like it was a grapefruit. Is that the the one in the front? His mouth is held like the guy who was holding one of the girls. I feel like I'm onto something, but I feel like I'm not because I'm, I never am. The producers don't want you in this picture. They say it's too controversial. Believe that? Controversy is what you need. It's gonna bring people to the movie. Funny they don't want her in the movie because she's a corn star, but they literally are gonna show her naked in the movie. Make it make sense. Make it make sense. Your character, Veronica, is a powder keg. It could be the defining role of your career, which is why I need to know you're willing to do whatever it takes, as if your life depended on it. It does. Prove them all wrong together in a beautiful f***ing bloodbath. I love her little her accent. Come on. Bloodbath. That's how I think I sound in my head with my British accents. Bates Motel, okay? Do you know what this is? It's a motel from Psycho. I still need to watch that. I watched the few... Uh, couple episodes of Bates Motel, but I've never seen Psycho. I don't mean to be disrespectful, but this isn't a stag. Oh my gosh. Not a scene pearl everywhere now. Hundred screens. Are you listening to me? Yeah, I'll be there. Yeah, God, it's just... Ugh. Her like little subtle facial expressions are just amazing. And the way she can like still express things with her face with no eyebrows, even more amazing to me. Baby girl doesn't have eyebrows because she's the most like expressive actor when it comes to facial expressions. Horror is not art. Horror is literally one of the biggest arts when it comes to movies especially. Just think of me like a paparazzi. <laughs> Come on. Ooh, is she dreaming? She really do this? I know that's right, Pearl. You gonna lose more than your uh life. You keep it up. You're my lawyer, right? So if I tell you something, we've got confidentiality. Leave it with me. Now all you gotta worry about is being undeniable in that film. Gabish. Gabish. Go home. Learn your lines. Keep your mouth shut. That's always my go-to. I don't know nothing. I didn't see nothing. I didn't hear nothing. I don't know. I don't know. Can I help you? Oh, don't kill him. We already lost one black person. We can't lose another. Look, I ain't in that kind of business no more. Yep. This is just a video store and we're closing, so. Not the old man saying he wants some chocolate. Oh my gosh, no. Not in the back of the neck. Dead, okay, stop. Bruh. He's dead, okay, stop. Don't rip it out. Don't rip it out. Don't rip it out. I should have known his jawline was too sharp to last that long. We certainly are willing to do the hard yard. Who are we working with? Not the whole bottle of the bismol. Sir, you about to be stopped up for weeks. Never get a second chance to make a first impression. Ma'am, not she pulled the it back for everybody to see it. I feel like she did it. Did she pull it back to see if to see how she would react to see if like she was the one who did it? She got to walk too. Look, we don't think the Night Stalker committed these crimes, but whoever did, and you're the common denominator. How come you act like you don't want us to find out who did this? Sir, get out my face. This good cop, bad cop, ain't gonna do nothing but make me mad. Hey, hold up. All I want to see is this sick freak behind bars, hand to God. What am I supposed to do? <laughs> right? You're supposed to help me save the next girl's life. Hey, that's your job. Do I look like Olivia Benson? I need a volume. I need a volume. <laughs> the most precious thing we have in life is our time. We never have enough, especially on a production. I love Lily Collins, like, just face. She has a great face. It is what it is. She just has an amazing face. Molly Bennett, meet Maxine Minx. Pleased to meet you. We've all got blood on our hands now. 
literally or what 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 what, what does that mean did, did we also kill people my child corpse's scream has been immortalized in cinema history Maxine is looking at her like girl is you good girls gotta look out for one another in this business mm -mm. okay she gonna be a conniver she gonna be a conniver I told you not to play chicken, didn't I? Now let's try and do this without making a scene. No, let's do it. We on a set. They want a scene, so. Time to pay for your sins. Not the standoff on the Western set. <laughs> he jumped out, you sit down the stairs. Sir, sit your old ass down, please, before you pull a muscle. Uh oh, we're going to the, the psycho house. Excuse me. You can't be up there. Exactly. So get down. We're going to have to kill him at this point to get to get rid of him. Because I don't know what else to do. Oh, uh, Maxine, whatever's going on in your life that's interfering with this picture, squash it. I intend to. With the right boots, we can, we can get to squashing. We can squash some stuff. Ah! Come on. Mm-hmm. If I could go back to the 80s for just five minutes, I just want to go to the club. That's it. I just want to go to the club and dance real quick. Come back. I don't want to stay there too long. Oh yeah, she learned him. She about to get him. You gotta be a criminal because you're not a good detective. Oh! <laughs> Time to pay for your sins. He will look at the trap. You do got the devil in you. I told you not to mess with me. Fuck you, bitch. You came after me, sir. I told you to stop. You didn't. So here we are. Oh no, no, wait. <laughs> oh my god. Anything you want. Anything at all. You're gone. You're a goner. I will be that name, not King of God. Not I'm an atheist, but now praying. <laughs> Oh, that sucks. Residents living in fear are praying that you're supposed to help me save the next girl's life. When I hit a party in the hills tonight, this party is where the girls are being taken at. Let's see what she does first. When it takes five minutes to get to the top of this house on this little thick roller coaster, I'm not. That's my little girl. It is, isn't it like her actual father or something? Very good. I knew you'd come. Is that her dad? I miss you so much. That's crazy. Hollywood stole you from me. Satan is inside of you, my darling. But I can take him out. I see better not die of that. Oh! He did not do that. And she's making the scream face. Oh my Maxine? Maxine, this is this is your moment, girl. I need you to toughen up. I don't understand why we don't poke a hole in it. Her dad is literally saying. She should have shot him when she had the gun. I don't know why she handed it over. Don't be frightened. What is this awful tan he has? Like, that tan line stops you right there. Are we rolling? <laughs> I have come to save all lost children. I'm really just counting the wrinkles on his face. Play along with daddy now. Ah, the speed. Denounce your life of sin. You shall be marked. Hold the motherfucker! I was to say, he's filming evidence that he's the one who was killing all these other girls. Mass is ended! Put your hands up! Not mass is ended. Fight for your families! To the death! Ooh! Not her daddy running a cult. If I got shot by a man in a white robe, I would be pissed. <laughs> I really would. Ooh! Stab him. Thank you. Maxine sure didn't know how to pick a body part. Maxine, stay here. Backup's on the way. So am I. Oh, 
don't this ain't no fun when a rabbit gets a gun. Listen, Maxine is not the one to, to you don't want to give a shotgun to Maxine. She not gonna miss. Maxine! Over here. Put pressure on the wound. I don't feel too bad. You got enough for playing bad cop kid. Oh, not the cross in her eye. I tried to give you what you wanted. To be just like your daddy. Forgive me. Failing a child is the greatest sin of all. She gonna be a star, all right, if they think that she's the one who did all this. The horrifying saga finally comes to an end. We are also joined tonight by Maxine Mink, star of the upcoming film. She got her a uh, star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. Maxine, I gotta thank God for orchestrating this all. No, you see them with their media training now. Is this a dream? Did she just like see all of this while she was standing there? Come on, eighties. Here we go. Give me the. Not the Chinese media show. Oh, she's a star. She's made it. After all you've been through. Come on, the Puritan too. That the Maxine Mink story will be going into production soon with. A Girl, but she got a story to tell. Any words of encouragement for young girls trying to make it big in Hollywood? Don't. Never give up. It's hard work. I mean, Maxine went to hell and back. There's a phrase my daddy always used. Oh, Lord. I will not accept the life I do not deserve. It wasn't real. It wasn't real. Or was it? I will not accept a life I do not deserve. <laughs> Ooh, a shotgun. Girl, is she? I thought she was using a typewriter. Girl, can yeah, you are. I think if this was real, Hollywood would have turned on her. On Maxine, they would have been mad that her dad was the serial killer and killed her mom. Right, we've got one more setup left of the dream sequence. Come see your head. Come see your head. Any idea what you want to do next? It got everyone's attention. Her daddy literally made her a star. I just never wanted a man. She wanted fame and she got it. Uh, I liked it. I really did like it. I felt like it was a good wrap up of this franchise. Um, If I had to rank them, X. Maxine Pearl. I just, I don't know. I like getting to the nitty gritty of it. But don't get me wrong. Pearl, phenomenal acting. I think Mia Goth's acting is the best in Pearl. If we were going off Mia Goth's acting, it would go Pearl, Maxine X. What I'm noticing with all these movies in the franchise, I love how each movie kind of has its own theme and um, I guess atmosphere. Like the first one feels very much like a traditional horror movie. And I think it was a great introduction into it and then Pearl I guess each movie fits its time but Pearl seemed like more of a classic movie in the sense of the time period that they were putting us in with really getting into Pearl's mind and then this one felt like a 80s crime thriller I really liked it I had fun but I can see how this franchise not be for everyone but I loved Maxine there's nothing really bad I can say about it I felt like for the franchise. It did what it needed to do. Mia Goth acted down. She looked so good. I loved her hair. Baby girl's facial expressions. On point with no eyebrows. I can't get over that. If you guys had a good time, remember to comment, like, and subscribe. If you want to see the full reaction, you can join down below and become a member here on YouTube or you can join on Patreon. You do need your own copy of the movie to sync up. I do not show the whole movie. Follow me on Twitter and I do talk about these movies over there. I love this franchise. I had the best time reacting to it. Um, but that's all I've got today and I will see you guys next time. And we can ride the boogie, share that beat of love. I wanna ride the boogie.